Entering the alpha level of the mind is simpler than you might think, and we've all experienced it, whether we realize it or not. Simply put, it means operating at a slower brain frequency, linked with light levels of sleep, relaxation, and daydreaming. Our brain operates like a computer on electrical energy, and this energy pulsates or vibrates at various speeds throughout the day. In a 24-hour period, when we are awake, going through our day, our brain frequency pulsates 20 times or 20 cycles per second. This 20 cycles per second frequency is what's called the beta brainwave frequency or outer consciousness in the mind control terminology. When you are daydreaming or just going to sleep but not quite there or just awakening but not yet awake, you are in alpha. Mind control people call this inner consciousness at this level, the brain frequency slows down anywhere from 7 to 14 cycles. Now this is where Jose Silva's mind control method comes in. Silva, who originally worked in the field of electronics, wanted to help his kids do better in school and life in general. While researching the alpha level, he found that the strong and stable frequency of the brain is very similar to the most effective electrical circuit with the least resistance. So he figured it made sense to do our mental work, thinking and decision making at this level where there were fewest obstacles. He says that at this brainwave level, one can use both left and right brain hemispheres for thinking, which leads to better decision making. And it is also at this level where one's intuition kicks in and starts working. Silva also noted that most successful people think and make decisions at the alpha level. They can reach this level without falling asleep. Instead, they stay mentally active to analyze information, make decisions, and then take action in beta. In contrast, most people do their thinking as well as they take action at the beta level. He believed that the key to one's success is to be able to use the alpha level with conscious awareness. It means activating your mind, analyzing information, and solving problems at this level. You can access more information stored in your memory banks, tap into your intuition, and even receive guidance from higher intelligence at the alpha level. When it comes to meditation, the term alpha level takes on a specific meaning, representing a unique state of the mind. In certain meditation practices, achieving this state is the primary goal, aiming to clear the mind of conscious thoughts for a peaceful calm. However, the mind control method, as taught by Jose Silva, goes further by teaching individuals to actively use the alpha level of the mind for problem solving. Like Jose Silva says in his book, you are learning to use more of your mind and to use it in a special manner.